everyone. Good night. It's 23, 22 hours in the United Kingdom on the 7th of August. Just making it because I thought I'd just share a little word, a little gratitude word and have a toast with you lovely people. This is a little bit of tea. I don't usually drink or eat after 10 o'clock but I just thought I'll come in and say cheers happy birthday to me 41 today but more importantly i just wanted to just share a little word with you lovely people fans and followers who follow my journey of women's health and who believe in women's health and are supporting me and have been supporting me this is greatly appreciated i thank you and it's been a manic day to say the least both mentally, physically, you name it. And highlights today. I did a bit of gritty job in my bathroom. You know when you have like unwanted, unpleasant hair goes everywhere in the blog hole. And I knew what to do. My dad bought me a plunger before. And it's like today the penalty dropped because I thought oh I just plunge it out and when I started doing it all the unpleasant stuff basically started coming out of the plug hole and this is great because now I don't have to get the people out and it might not cost me anything so I just tell my housing association so kudos to doing jobs oneself even if it's gritty and yeah Life's about lesson learning and it was just great. And second highlight is I made it into Duolingo finals of the Spanish League, Diamond League. So just in time, I just did it tonight. So that was great. And on my birthday as well. So that was amazing. And I just wanted to really come in and say it's nice. And I'm grateful. I'm so grateful today. That I'm alive and I've lived to see and I am now 41 even though I don't like getting older and <laughs> my, my age is going up and up but I'm just so grateful so cheers happy Sunday and I'll be with you all lovely people shortly I'm gonna settle down now and just chill bye for now lovely people love you everyone 10th of August here I just wanted to come in and share my thoughts I'm well good morning it's been three days I am into 41 doesn't really feel no different really to be fair yesterday I got a lovely couple of cards from my nieces and my nephew and the words in the cards really touched me particularly what my nephew said I cried and what today I woke up thinking of family and I feel touched and I feel blessed and I feel grateful to have a family even though sometimes one can have personality clashes one could sometimes have disgruntled families we all can have disgruntled families but take time for your loved ones today take time for yourself take time for the people that is most important to you and the people that make you feel good as well to build up your mental health as well as well-being going forward and i'll say happy wednesday i'm just gonna do my morning weigh-in midweek weigh-in should i say and get a cup of tea and start my day shortly although i feel just to stay in bed again and just have lazy days on my ministration but story of my life but aside from that i'm well i'm good i'm feeling good and positive about the day as well 
and happy Wednesday everyone and I'm going to be doing a video like a short documentary soon about the younger over 40 self and the older over 40 self mean mean me nowadays and some activities and I'll put a voiceover but that's not going to probably be ready as yet so I'll provide a nice video on Saturday I'll choose one bye for now lovely people good afternoon lovely people it's over 40s health here just wanted to come in and say Sunday the 14th of August was a manic day for me so to speak well let's just say in a nutshell I had my menstruation twice in a month and I will be going to the doctors and checking myself out more intensely to see if I'm lacking in any vitamins or minerals or anemic and hence why I didn't put any shots for that day but I just wanted to give you a little voice over and a little snapshot of my life to date hope you like the video bye for now hello friends i just wanted to really come in today and give a heart to heart and <laughs> i feel quite tearful when i'm talking to you and as well as i was just taking my notice boards friends because you just got to be careful with personal information but aside from that friends i kind of wanted to come in and give a heart to heart talk really a lot has happened as you know <laughs> story of my life personally over 40 self but i'm just writing a letter to my parents because i'm just taking time to just update them but i think sometimes in a month i would write a letter to them because i think it's more personal do you ever find that but that's not what i wanted to say without going off on a tangent I will be doing some shopping hauls. I'm doing my main shop this August in the Tesco's United Kingdom because they have some deals and I'll show you that at a later date in another video. But what I really wanted to say is and more prominently is that sometimes when you insert a situation, particularly my situation after a health situation and two years on, yeah, it's been a journey and yeah, sometimes my ministrations last a bit longer than it should like longer than seven days like seven to ten days do you ever find that if you have that but aside from that i find that once i get the vitamins i need it's all right and yeah onwards and upwards for the possibilities and that was not what I was going to say either. I was just going to say that sometimes you have to take the rough with the smooth. You have to take your current situation and make the best out of it possible. So if you're unemployed, for example, it's gritty, but deal with it in a positive way. That's what I meant to say. And I will put this little segment of an outtake in my video of documentary because I'm doing a little documentary of the before over 40 self after before surgery and after one so if you want to check this out go to my youtube channel over 40 self and I might do a teaser for the documentary for tiktok as well bye for now lovely people happy tuesday 16th of august bye morning fans followers what a manic morning it is going to get my Tesco's main shop in now kind of tired booked it for 8 and 9 but if I go now at least I've got it in and I can get do some things and uh, get some nice meals prepared because I had nothing friends 
I had no fruits, no vegetables, nothing. Oh, I'll tell you about the situation later in the Asda. Sometimes it's good to go with your gut. I was a little bit tired this morning. I didn't really want to go. I was umming and ahhing. But I feel good that I went. Come with me. Let's go for a drive and let's pick up the Tesco shopping. Bye for now. Hello everyone. I think my shopping's coming. Yeah, I'll talk to you later. The colleague looks like it's coming out to... He or she is coming out to give me my shopping. And then we can have some breakfast. Bye for now. lovely people welcome you can see i'm really happy today ah oh, well without further ado welcome to over 40s health page 1209 in the united kingdom hello welcome highlight of my day is i've got oh, i love to just be careful oh bend my knees I've got this massive bml box as you can see I'm going to open that in a minute because I just put in some gratitude for the company really good products not affiliate for the company but very good company products I was going to say that got a bit tongue tied there but aside from that it's very good company products if you want to look after your gut health digestive health health in general I tried one of their products and immediately about three weeks ago now I had to put in feedback because I'm just so grateful friends after my surgery to have and to be able to try so many different products today and that when I feel it's helping my digestive system and my health going forward I have to show my gratitude but no one asked me to do that and everyone can live as they will but yeah i just wanted to take time say happy friday come in and let's unbox this together so yeah don't you just love parcels i love them i love them so much and this by the way tiktokers if you see this video this is a little segment of the video, full length video on YouTube that I'm going to put out. So it's going to be a little documentary slash shopping halts, video diaries of things that has happened to me in August. And I'll be doing these little snippets, some longer form documentaries. So one day I'll maybe do a feature film of my life, but these little snippets. So yeah. So if you want to tune in, head over to my YouTube, Over 40's Health. Oh, look at that. Hey, Over 40's Health, they didn't say that. They put my name, but just for security reasons. We really hope you enjoy this bundle of probiotic goodness. We know your gut will. We hope you enjoy our new summer flavour at much as, as much as we do. Keep on spreading the gut love much love the biomel team ah oh, this is so good this is so good friends i'm just so happy you might be able to see that there he doesn't want to focus for me and it's the light Come on. Just 
be able to see it out. Oh, it doesn't really want to focus for me, friends. Yeah, there, there we go. They wrote me a lovely little letter. So, yeah. Wrote me a lovely little letter. Right there. So that's really lovely. And, yeah. Come on down, head on down to my YouTube and you can check out the full length video. These are the gut health, different gut health products that they do. They sh gave me one of these. It's dairy free, gluten free, lactose free, vegan and 100% natural. And yeah, that's great. And they got a new strawberry flavour as they said. So I'm going to do this and get these in the fridge. So let's show you. Ooh. Oh, this is the ice packs they said it's come in. Wow. Oh, it's cold. Yeah. But it has to be stored at a certain temperature. So they know. They know what they're doing. They're trained, I guess. They know about health as well, so kudos to them. Wow, look at this. I got Belgian chocolate, which I tried, which is really nice. Another Belgian chocolate. Wow, this is amazing, friends. Like Christmas come early. I've got natural coconut. Another natural coconut one. Another natural coconut one. I've got an almond salted caramel one. I've got a strawberry one. That's their newest flavour, friends. Belgium chocolate one again. Almond salted caramel. Almond salted caramel. Strawberry one, newest flavour. So it should be in the stores by now. My present was supposed to come on the third, but a little kerfuffle with the parcel and the delivery company, and because I gave them my PO box address, the service that they have in the UK called DPD couldn't uh, available I was gonna say couldn't deliver to a PO box address but I gave them my real address and yeah so they're gonna put my review on the website like other people's review sometimes goes on their website and they'll show me it's just been absolutely amazing friends and I think sometimes it's nice to show gratitude do you know what I mean to show a bit of gratitude because it doesn't cost anything to be kind. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. I know you do. Lovely people. We've got a pure vanilla flavour. That would be nice to try. Might do a taste test with some of you at a later date. We've got another almond salted caramel. They all sound lovely flavours. Pure vanilla flavour. Strawberry flavour, which is their newest flavour, which I'm sure you heard me say twice this video. Pure vanilla flavour. And almond salted caramel flavour. So, I'm going to get these in the fridge so they can store at the right temperature. And yeah, so we got, I would say I've got. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, fourteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. I've got seventeen bottles. Wow, that's amazing. Seventeen bottles of Biomel products. Wow, this is amazing. I didn't know they was gonna send so many, but I'm so grateful. 
on touch. It just made me feel appreciated, loved, different flavours. Yeah, and yeah, you've got to give these a try. They really are good. I tried, as I said, I tried the Belgium chocolate one at first in my local Sainsbury's. I saw it for a cut price, 125 I believe. I said, I've got to try that. Got home, drank it little bit by little bit, and it was amazing. I can feel instantly it worked on my gut because it helped with constipation. And I'm no medical expert, but... It really did good for my gut and yeah, I would just say give these a go. Happy Friday everyone. Have a lovely Friday. Take time for yourself and I hope you enjoy the video of a little snippet, a snapshot of my life and what's been happening this August today. A little bit ups and down with my health but I'm on a good way. I'm trying to work with my body after my myomectomy surgery. Bye for now lovely people, happy Friday, stay safe and remember, treat yourself kindly because you know how much you're worthy. Bye.